you can see behind me, this house is completely destroyed after it erupted into flames early Sunday morning. Crews tell us when they arrived, they found the man living inside the house dead. When something tragic like this happens, you just it, your heart just melts. Wanda Giles was a neighbor to James Robert Madison, the 47 year old man that was found dead after his house caught on fire. It's in my community, not just Spartanburg County, but right around the corner. The house is located near the intersection of Brown Arrow Circle and Highway 11 in Inman. According to emergency dispatch, the call came around 4.30 a.m. The new Prospect Fire Department responded, and when they arrived, they found Madison dead inside the house. It just seems like when these kind of things happen, you know either that person or you know somebody connected to that person, and you don't want to wait till after the fact you could have done something. If it's just show up and say, I'm sorry, you know, I'm sorry. Giles adding, even in tragedy, she hopes the community can come together. I don't know why this happened, what the circumstances are around why this happened. You don't have to know to love the family. Madison's family did not want to go on camera, but says he was deeply loved. Now, I did see someone from the fire department go inside and start investigating. We're told we still don't know the cause of the fire, but a forensic exam is scheduled for Monday. In Inman, Sophia Radabaugh, 7 News. We will, of course, keep you updated online and on air with any new information that we do get on this developing story. A deputy is expected to be okay after a car crash and chase in Greenville County. The sheriff's office says it started just